Hello, people. My name's Jeff. I've got a dream that I believe was from God, and it was about a and a half ago, and it's about a asteroid that is towards the Earth and going to hit the Earth, or so I think. Um, pray to God about that, ask for discernment, and ask for Him to tell you the truth, but here it is. Um, Yeah, I had a dream of a meteor coming to Earth about to cause, or to cause massive destruction. Um, it looked as if, first of all, I could see it from the, uh, like I was up in space next to it, and it was coming towards the Earth at high rate of speed, um, and I could see it getting closer to me, um, and the asteroids right to me, um, and I could see point on the earth that wasn't moving so everything else was moving today um, and skydive for a living for about five and a half years there's a point when you're getting to the ground that doesn't move and that's your point of impact and that's what I could see from um, the position of the asteroid coming towards the earth and that position was right here right. Yeah. So if you can see, it's just to the west of, uh, northwest of South America, and I guess just west of Southern Central America was the point of impact. But then um, it showed me the asteroid from a side view like I was going next to it, and it looked like a man, and it looked like a... Um, like it was just a rock, a space rock in the shape of a man. So, um, I guess a man like this. With the arms out to the side, like this, and legs slightly, uh, slightly spread apart like that. Um, And then it was just, it was slowly rotating, like this. So the man was just slowly flipping space as it went towards the earth. And then after that, um, well, I guess while it was still showing me it coming towards that point, um, it said, when I say it, I mean some narr like narration voice, which I've never had in a dream before never had a narrator. I don't usually hear voices too well. Um, I can usually remember like what we're talking about if I'm in a conversation, but I can't remember any words. Uh, but this I can remember um, a voice in the background and it said it will hit near Puerto Rico. Um, and which that didn't make sense to me because based off the point that it showed me of the point of impact, but then it flashed to another section, and uh, the other, or I guess a new part of the dream, and the it showed the ocean and the asteroid hitting it at a very shallow angle. Um, so, and I came to, or I believe that that was a piece of the asteroid that broke off. Um, that's what it just seemed like at the time. And so I don't know at one, what point that's going to break off or whatever. I don't even know if this is true. This is just what I believe. So, um, and that's pretty much the whole dream. And uh, I didn't make a video immediately because I didn't think I was supposed to. And I asked God multiple times. By the way, I believe in God and Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior. And he's given me many dreams. Um, three which have come to pass but a lot that haven't and I've been deceived before uh, so I don't want to I don't want to do that again um, and I don't want to deceive any of you guys so I ask that you pray to God uh, for discernment and for knowledge of this and I'm also not good at interpreting dreams so I don't know if it's symbolic or if it is um uh, really going to happen or that's the way it is but it seemed like that's the way it is except for the fact that it was a man 
that seem kind of symbolic, like the shape of the space rock. Um, I guess it could be like that, um, that it was dark. Um, I remember that. And then the other, when I've asked God about it multiple times, especially earlier tonight, um, cause I, I work a night schedule or a night shift, so my schedule's backwards, but, um, that would be the morning for me. He led me to the, let me grab my Bible real quick. It's in Revelation. Sorry about that. It was Revelation 8. Oh, okay. Pretty sure it was here. Yeah, okay. Revelation 8, 10 through 12. And the third angel sounded, and there fell a great star from heaven, burning as it were a lamp, and it fell upon the third part of the rivers and upon the fountains of the waters. And the name of the star is called Wormwood, and the third part of the waters became Wormwood, and many men died of the waters because they were made bitter. And then, um, I don't know if this has to do with this or not, but this is like another dream that started right after this. And... Uh, I was looking up at the night sky and I saw, I saw something beside the moon um, and it was only in darkness and then it came into the light and it looked like a coin um, but with three heads on it and something else on it which I don't know what it was um, but the three heads um, Oh, I saw it, and the people around me um, saw it the moment it was revealed. And it was close to the size of the moon. Um, and it looked like Mount Rushmore, but with only three heads. Um, if any of you guys can give um, any feedback, or if you can pray and ask God for interpretation, um, that would be awesome. I would appreciate it. And uh, I believe that... Jesus is coming soon, and he has done literal miracles for me in my life, and uh, I guess I'll pray for you guys and for myself um, real quick, and then that's it. Thank you. Holy Father in heaven, Yeshua, please hear our prayer. God, please bless these people that watch this video. I pray that you anoint them with the Holy Ghost and bless them with wisdom and encouragement and edification from what you've given me, Lord. I pray for discernment for them, and I pray for the revealing of truth in Jesus' name. God, please bless them and gird their loins in the truth. Please give them the sword of the Spirit, the shield of the faith, thy breastplate, of righteousness and thy helmet of salvation. He stod their feet in thy preparation of thy gospel of peace. I pray for their uh, your hedge of protection of fire around their bodies, minds, spirits, and souls. Lord, please protect them 
and the fiery darts being cast at them from the enemy, Lord. And please let them not be ensnared by the lies of the devil. God, please send your angels to protect us round about, and I plead the pure, pure blood of the Lamb over us, Lord, and our brothers and sisters in you. In Jesus' name, please be with all those that are broken and lost as I was, Lord. And please reach out and save them as you saved me. I pray for miracles and mountains to be moved in your holy name tonight for these people, Lord. Please speak to them in a way that only you can speak to them. Please show them your truth. I pray for their salvation in Jesus' holy name. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Praise Yeshua. Praise Yahweh for all eternity. Thanks, guys.